you know, if you went way back to the uh, 1800s, everything, the reason that this became a farming community was the, the miners came here to mine gold and mm -hmm. there wasn't anything to eat. They shot all the deer and shot all the elk. And, and by 1858 and 59, the, the miners got hungry for cabbage <laughs> and potatoes and stuff like that. So this area got settled about 1858, 1859 as a support for the miners in the mountains. So all the food came local. You know, whether it was wheat right here, right here on Belmont, it was a mill, a wheat mill, where they milled wheat for making flour and uh, all the produce. And then that continued, you know, from 1858 way into this century, the 20th mm -hmm. century, last century. And then it, it as shipping became real big and the big, air, the big uh, stores came in, then they started shipping everything in, mostly from California. And then there, <coughs> 1975 with the farmer's market, mm -hmm. there was a resurgence at that time of a few people buying local. I think the first time we picked uh, two, three bushels of green beans and took it down to the first farmer's market in 1975, I think it was, and sat there in the courthouse, uh, in front of the courthouse on, on Pearl Street. It wasn't a mall yet. Sold those uh, uh, beans. I can still see Dave Bull Duke uh, from Boulder Bookstore saying, uh, well, if you're going to sell these beans, you've got to have some bags to put them in. So he ran off to a store and come back with some little paper bags because we had a scale, but we didn't have any bags to put them in. <laughs> you know, we didn't have a table. We didn't have a card table. We just had the trunk of our car.